This is the Rode NT1A, one of the best-selling studio condenser microphones of all time. With over 6 million units sold, Rode have taken this microphone to the next level. For all my fellow producers, singer-songwriters and content creators, please welcome the NT1 5th Generation Black. So about 10 years ago, back in 2012, I got my hands on a Rode NT1A. At the time, this microphone was found in almost every home studio, offering the look, accessories and crystal clear sound at a super affordable price. This microphone has been with me since the beginning and when Rode reached out about their brand new NT1 5th generation, I had to check it out. Coming standard with previous NT1A and NT1 models, the 5th generation comes with a shock mount, pop filter, XLR cable and dust cover. Compared to previous models, the accessories are very much the same, except for the strikingly red XLR cable and black black USB-C cable. Yes, you heard that correctly, this new NT1 5th generation has both a USB and XLR connection. Tucking both connections in such a compact space, this is how you do it. Not having the USB connection on the outside of the microphone really helps keep the clean look we all love and don't get me started on the black body and silver grille. This design looks fantastic. Now, from what I can tell, Rode definitely took their time with this microphone since the last NT1 release. This new NT1 5th generation offers some of the craziest specs that other microphones don't have. First, as mentioned earlier, we've got both XLR and USB connecting options. Sure, microphones were one of the first to put this combination together, but it is a first for me regarding studio condensers. When you connect this microphone via XLR, Rode state it's very much a standard NT1. Expect the same extreme low noise levels and crispy tonal clarity. On the USB side of things though, this is where this microphone takes standards to the next level. We've got 32 bit float recording, which means clipping your audio is nearly impossible. And we've got advanced DSP, which means latency should not be a problem. Advanced DSP is usually controlled using some sort of software and in this case we've got Rode Central up and running. For great sound right out of the box, the basic mode offers easy to adjust settings and advanced setting is for those of you who want full control. I personally like to keep things simple so basic mode it is. Now there are a lot of things to cover when it comes to this new NT1 5th generation microphone but we're all wondering whether the USB option sounds as good as the XL our version we all love. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. I, I don't work hard when it's easy. I put in work when it's hard. Girl, I never believed in love until I had yours. This is more than a season, and I'm not just wrong. I'm not afraid to tell you. That you're the one The one I wake up thinking about The one I can run to when I'm feeling down Life is all good when you're around Girl, nobody from the past is beating you right now Cause I'll take you home to mama I'll let you meet my friends And you don't come with drama So I love you till the world ends you ain't more than worth it And I don't feel like I deserve it You've got the pieces You're my kind of perfect so, right off the bat, the USB option sounds fantastic. Like, I 100% approve the USB connection for pro vocals. The XLR input does sound similar to previous NT1 models, but for me, it's the USB connectivity, 32-bit float recording, and built-in advanced DSP. That makes this microphone special. Whether you are just starting out or you're looking for your next upgrade, from someone that has used the NT1 for over 10 years, Years, this microphone is money well spent.